Rejoice Joyce Reborns. I am here with the beautiful Joyce Anna. And you all realize I won't be able to say that much longer because when her little brother arrives, I will have to say hello everybody and welcome to Re Rejoice Reborns. I'm here with the Joyce Anna, with the beautiful Joyce Anna and the handsome little peanut, which will be replaced with his name, but I'm not revealing his name or his pictures until he gets here. Uh, I just wanted to do a changing video today. It's such a gorgeous day outside. I wore my spring coat, but I ended up having to take it off. Uh, I wanted to show you what we found at uh, Walmart for $3, which amazing amazed me. It was the last pair of these cute little shoes she's wearing and they were three dollars three dollars at Walmart I kid you not I said to my husband go check the price of this so he took it to one of them price checkers he beeped it and he came back to me with a look on his face and I thought he was gonna say you know twenty nine dollars because he had this look on his face like no way and he always gets that look on his face when something is like over what it should be worth. So he's like, how much do you think these shoes are worth? And I was like, I don't know, $10. And he's like, three bucks. And I'm like, no way. And he's like, yep, three bucks. And these were the last pair and I grabbed them. Now I was looking for a pair of little boys and I didn't see any. So that being said, I'm going to keep my eye out. But today I am changing her from her beautiful little outfit that I just love her in and I really don't want to change her to this beautiful little outfit that I love her in only we grabbed up her a new pair of pants to go with it instead of just like she has a plain peach ones and then the other ones that go with this uh, they're gray with white polka dots little teeny tiny white polka dots and I thought why not my husband found these, he's like, look, honey, and I wasn't sure if she had them, so we got them anyways, just in case, and I kept the receipt, but she doesn't have them, and I just think they're absolutely gorgeous, and we did get a couple more things for her little brother, who I'm calling Little Peanut, until he arrives. My husband and I have decided on a name for him, but it will not be revealed until he gets here so Wednesday he is being sent out from the USA to me in Canada and I think maybe he'll take like I don't know how long to get here because he's going out priority with tracking and insurance right so he should maybe take five to ten days because I imagine they'll stop him at the border and x-ray him and all that so I don't know if they'll open him up or they'll just x-ray the box because they can pretty well tell that nothing that shouldn't be in there is in there when they x-ray it I just love her little toes I love 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 them I'm gonna keep those socks on her even though I took them off her, I do want to change her diaper because it's been a few days. And I'd like to freshen her up with some nice, beautiful baby powder scent. I have my patio door open and my screen across, letting a beautiful breeze in. I just love this outfit on her. I love the Winnie the Pooh outfits on her. She looks so cute in them. I got her little brush out to brush her hair. Oh, and Willow is so interested in her. She's like right here. Here, Willow, come in so everybody can see you. Nobody can see you over there. She's kissing me because I'm talking to the camera. And she does not understand it. Oh, my goodness. I don't know if you guys can see her, but look at her hair. <laughs> She always gets little fuzzies in her hair from the hats. Whatever. Yeah, I am not revealing what he looks like. He is a sleeping Thomas kit, though. But no, they're not going to be 
twins. I was thinking of making them twins, and then I thought, no. No. I mean, I could dress them in the same, like, I could get him a little brother outfit and her a big sister outfit, but they're not going to be fraternal twins. Even though they're the same size. 17 inches, his kid is. And he, she's 3 pounds, 14 ounces, and I think he's he's just under 4 pounds as well. I think he's 3 six or something like that, the, the lady I bought him off of said. I'm not sure if you guys can see her with the way my... Yeah, you can. With the way my camera angle is, I do want to give her a nice, fresh baby powder diaper. I went on to um, McPherson's craft site. They're actually in St. Mary's, which isn't far from me. And uh, they have some hospital diapers on there. Or, not hospital diapers, I'm sorry. Hospital, uh... Oh, my goodness. It left me. Receiving blankets. They have hospital receiving blankets on McPherson Craft. And they're like, I think they were $3.99 each or $5.99 each. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, I still have the sniffles from the other day, y'all. And uh, I wanted to get one, so I ordered one. And I was like, you need a minimum order of $15. So I'm like, oh my goodness. I have to order $15 worth of receiving blankets or whatever else I want on the site in order to have it delivered or I could just like give my aunt or my friend the gas money to take me out there and uh, I could just pick them up I'm not sure if they have them in store though so I think I'm just going to order the $15 worth of receiving hospital receiving blankets because I can so use them so much I could use them in role plays and speaking of role plays I am going to I'm so sorry y'all my batteries died anyways as I was saying what was I saying I don't remember what I was saying speaking of role plays that's what I was saying speaking of that's Willow, y'all. Speaking of role plays, Willow, go lay down, honey. Rob, can you give her a stick and Max a stick, please? Thank you. Speaking of role plays, I am going to be doing a role play um, for Joyce Anna because she was just made for, like, for me when I bought her. Well, she wasn't made for me, but she was made and then I bought her. The role play I did, as you can see on my videos, was that I was pregnant and I went into labor with her. For this little peanut, I almost said his name, the role play I'm going to do is that my husband and I are adopting because my heart has always been with the third world needy children countries. So I'm going to be doing a role play that my husband and I are going over to a country to adopt our little peanut. And that will be coming soon. Uh probably within the week. Look, I just noticed that Joyce Anna can practically sit up by herself. I don't like to do it, but she can. Well, she's just a preemie. And I always worry about the diapers on her legs. That's why I want to get, like, the newborn size. I think the newborn size would fit her. What is mommy doing to you better than the preemie diapers? These are size one, though. Oh my goodness. I can't wait till like summer comes and I can put her in her little dresses and take her out and or just leave her in like a little onesie and so watch for that role play. Also, I checked the other night and we are at 36 subscribers as of like last night. So, yeah. 100 subscribers giveaway is still on. We're just a little big on her. This one, I'm not sure what size it is. We're still on. Um, 
zero to three months, but it's a big zero to three months. That's okay, though. Get up there, Joyce. Where are you going? So, yeah, I'm excited. I want to be able to do the giveaway soon, and I know it will happen soon. So, I, when I change her diapers, I find the old diapers I don't throw unless I use for a role play and it's like messy and, and gross. If I do like a, a, a poop or pee role play. Um, I keep her old diapers until they are like bunched up and they can't be used no more and then I chuck them or they are used for role play and get wet somehow damaged or uh, role play poopy and then I throw them out and for my baby poop in the role play I like to use a combination. I know a lot of you guys use baby food. What I was using was, I love her feet, y'all, was a combination of mustard and maple syrup. I know it's gross, but it looked like baby poop. So I'm probably going to also pick up a couple uh, jars of baby food to use as baby poop but that's what I use in the role play so, this is like a little dress but I just put the little tights on underneath I just love this on her so I just wanted to come on and say hello to everybody and I haven't had a video up in a couple days She looks so amazing. She could like wear any color and just be fabulous. I don't have this color sock for her, so she's just going to wear the sock she had on. I'm sure she's fine with that. But she's just like any color I put her in. She's, I just, stunning. Stunning, stunning, stunning. And when she wears her shoes, I like to make sure her socks are nice and up to her knees so that the shoes don't, don't uh, rub on her paint. And even in sleepers, I'll keep socks on her. I think there was a night I put a sleeper on her. I didn't put any socks on her, but I usually keep always keep a onesie and socks on her. I mean, that's what I did when my kids were little, so my kids are all growing up now. They're not kids anymore, they're teenagers. My son is a young man, he's going to be 18, and my daughter is 16, and she'll be 17. So, yeah. Talk about empty nest syndrome. But anyways, getting away from the sad topics, I am so excited for, I almost said his name again, Little Peanut, to arrive. I don't know if I want to keep these shoes on her, honestly. We'll put that set on her that her daddy bought for her. Mmm, meeny miny mo. I just... Like, the lace part of the shoes goes with the set, but this lighter color, I think I am. I am going to keep her shoes off today, put them with her little Winnie the Pooh set. I, uh, I always sit chill on this box until I get a better setup, but, uh... I just put these batteries in and they're blinking. Why is it I'm always getting these 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 battery packs that uh, that aren't working for me lately? Like my husband just bought me these batteries. But yeah, I set you all up there so that you can watch what I do because oh, I didn't realize it had a bow on the back. 
I know I see random things that make me want to go off of topic. So y'all can see what I'm doing and I don't have to do stuff one handed. But when little peanut gets here, I will do the box opening and I will do the role play. And these batteries, I don't know if I should take them back because they're blinking already, telling me my camera batteries is low. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Maybe they were on the shelf for a long time. I don't know if my husband kept the receipt or not. Did you keep the receipt to those batteries? Because they are no good. No. Oh well. I'll get more. I will get more tomorrow. Yeah, they're kind of big on her, but still, I don't. You can't see what I'm doing, anyways. But then again, like I make like eight-minute-long videos, so yeah. I'm gonna put the little scratch mittens on her. Well, I mean, like, this one section is eight minutes long. And then, who knows how long the other section is that I recorded. And almost done. I combed her hair and I'm putting a hat on her head. And we were in Baby's Arrest the other day, and they do have a preemie section. But... They, babies are us is ridiculously expensive. Oh my goodness! Ta-da! Alright, y'all. There is a beautiful little nest. I love putting her arms up. It just looks so real with her arms up like that. I'm gonna let y'all go. See you later. Bye for now.